Eight men accused of involvement in the rape and murder of an eight-year-old Muslim girl in India's Jammu and Kashmir state appeared in court on Monday for the first hearing in a case that sparked nationwide outrage and criticism of the ruling party. Police said the girl from a nomadic community in Kashmir was drugged, held captive in a temple and sexually assaulted for a week before being strangled and battered to death with a stone in January. The accused had pleaded not guilty. The national outrage over the incident has drawn parallels with the massive protests that followed the gang rape and murder of a girl on a Delhi bus in 2012. After Monday's initial hearing in Srinagar, the judge adjourned the case until April 28, while the Supreme Court considers a request from the lawyer representing the victim's family to have trial held elsewhere due to fears for her safety. Two of the eight on trial are police officers who stand accused of being bribed to stifle the investigation. According to the charge sheet filed by police last week, the attack was part of a plan to drive the nomads out of Katwa's district in Jammu, the mostly Hindu portion of India's only Muslim-majority state. Yet, India has long been plagued by violence against women and children, where reported rapes climbed 60% from 2012 to 40,000 in 2016, and many more go unreported, especially in rural areas.